How's it going? This is Game Edge. We're back in Mist Survival. We built ourselves a watchtower on that side. I definitely want to try one on that side, but right now, that's definitely very costly. <laughs> it's a bit expensive for us to build those. Uh, there's a, yeah, it takes a quite a bit of the actual scrap, which I need a lot more of. So we're probably going to take a little bit of a rest on building that and go out and get some more loot. We're, the only problem is I'm going to need some more storage too. So we'll probably the best thing to do is get the loot as fast as we possibly can. <laughs> Poor Leo. I swear to God. Hopefully the dev will fix that up for next time. It'd be kind of nice to not have the poor doggy go into the ground like that. It would be, uh, you know, extra nice. Again, if you guys and girls are joining us, you know what you do. Show some love. Hit the like button. If you're brand new, of course, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Be part of the community. Thank you all wonderful members out there. Thunderstruck members. Every all members out there. Thank you so much. Patreon all the way around on YouTube. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. For all your amazing support and all the kind donations out there. Thank you for taking time to do that. Super thanks. All right. Let's do this. Scott. Uh, we're going to need to find ourselves some leftover center blocks over here. It's only needed uh, seven more. So I'm going to check out the barns like people were saying to do. Let's go and check out the barns. Make sure that is good to go. Look, Leo knows we're going. Did you just walk over the... Leo, what the freak, dude? Just give me a second. I got to go and open up this thing. Can't just drive through that, dude. And maybe go and kill off... Ah, you know, should I maybe use the other vehicle? Because we, we can go up there and just grab some carrots and stuff. I need to make myself some more meals. If I can. All right, Leo, you, you want to drive, right, dude? That's that's what it is. All right, I got it. I got it. You're trying to show me that point. I got gotcha. you. Uh, we'll go up there and just terrorize those poor people up there. Poor people. The bandits. The arseholes that come over and try and kill us all the time. We're going to check out these two farmhouses here. And I don't think there's anything much in them, but we'll just double check it uh, to see if we can find any cinder blocks. It would be really, really nice if we could find something. Then we need to go back to the old one too afterwards and our old base. I suppose I left over some lights and stuff. I definitely want to go pick those up. And he also mentioned his seeds may be hidden in a different area. There's a shelf that I might have missed. So that's possible. Yeah, I think this place only has buckets, doesn't it? Right here. Like, not as if I really need more buckets. I wonder if I can scrap those. You know, that'd be nice if we could actually have the ability of scrapping things. Like, anything at all. Like, if we just decide this is not needed, take it down. Even if we get just a tiny bit, I would appreciate it very, very much. No, nope, nothing in this one. I think this one's like a, a duddish one. It's not the greatest of all. And if I missed anything, you guys will get a confidence, of course, and tell me. I am guarantee that's going to happen. So I appreciate it very much, of course. All your wonderful stuff you guys are helping out with. All right, let's do it. All right, Leo. Not much of a great building here to go into. There is another one across over there. Now, we are carrying those wheels, which are friggin' heavy as hell. I don't have a ton of... of space in this. Just hold off, Leo. I'm going to leave the engine running. It won't be long, I guarantee you. Do I have a... Uh, I don't have one in here. Don't have a jerry can in case of emergency. There's definitely some stuff up top there. Let's get a jerry can for ourselves. We can utilize. Now we have extra fuel in there too, so it's not so bad. Don't worry, he'll pop into the vehicle. I asked him to stay. He won't stay. Sometimes he likes to do his own thing. All right, buddy. Oops. <laughs> now I'm just playing with him. It's like, stop it. All right, let's go and clear them out on top. Looks like everything is good there. She's still watching them. She just wants her fine garage up and running. I would really like to get it done as fast as we possibly can. I do need to go and get some loot a little bit further out too. Probably need some meat sooner or later, but not right now. So, you guys like coming into my town? I aim for the feet sometimes just to take them out cold. Make sure they're dead. Just roll over them a little bit. Just like that. See? Now we're extra sure they're dead. It might not be a full house because we did kill off one of them. There might be one in a cave there. I saw this guy before. Oops, double shot just to make sure you're dead dead. No, he's still missing some goods. There might be one in there. I thought I saw another one going down, but I, was, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. We're just rolling on the guy. It doesn't look like there's tons of dudes here. We'll grab the fuel from this. Of course, we didn't destroy these ones for a good reason. Are we clear here, dude? I think we're pretty clear. 
All right, engine's off. I'm just still take out my shotgun in case of emergency. I don't want to have any problems here. Uh, it looks like when I rolled over him, I kind of tossed him over to the side. So that turns out pretty bad for him, but pretty good for us. It's all good. And Leo is just like enjoying himself. I think he has peed on him. That's great. So we'll grab this and this. That is okay. And we'll grab some of your loot too, dude. I don't need your gloves, your winter gloves. Oh, carrot. Thank you. Don't really need the salt as much, but oh, I've got your pockets. All right, we'll do a quick little drop here. I think there's some stuff on top of here. And I don't think we looted this back up anyways since we respawned, so it's good. There might be some extra stuff we can grab from here. And we'll just toss that in there right now. We'll grab this, though. We want to keep that with us as much as we possibly can. All right. Um, yeah, it would suck if someone popped out. Four liters, holy moly. And a uh, nice little sparky right there. At 59, that's actually really nice. I think I only find usually like low-end ones, so that's I'm gonna grab it. I'm gonna take it. I'll spend it three minutes just in case of emergency. But you guys are right. Someone was mentioning confields. We definitely get better loot, uh, and well, fuel inside these vehicles. Best not to take these apart. I'll be honest with you. I always seem to find some pretty decent amount of fuel in these. Look at that. Like I'm seriously amazed by the amount we have. Well, the bandits are here. They're probably filling back up after siphoning the vehicles. We can't find anything in so. It's very possible. That's what they're doing. All right, let's go and, uh, oh, sure, I'll take that. Can I have some scrap for once? Now I'm finding the other stuff, you know, components. Let's double check here, Mr. Hard Hat. Okay. We got some broccoli. Actually, he gave me some stuff I actually need. That's beautiful. And we can't really do much with those anymore. So it is what it is. I just grabbed another one. I could put it into his inventory again and just get rid of it because we really don't need it. We have more enough. We can't do very much of those. Uh, right now, we don't have any need for it. We have a stockpile of them. A really big one. I don't know. Is there another guy in there? I don't, it doesn't look like it. Grab that, though. Clear out this loot that we can. Is there anything in the trunk? I didn't check to see. Or did I? I'm not positive. Might have done it without realizing clear this area out completely there's obviously no one here nothing here and i don't think there's anything on these tables or anything just gonna double check that there's nothing spawned back yeah there is something here we'll have to delete that too afterwards we're not gonna need that we don't have a garbage can on our current truck so this is more of a running gun kind of place for it nothing in the chitoir nothing in there Anything around here? I don't think so. Oh, yep. There's something there. Some bark chips. Which is kind of handy anyways, so it's all good. I think they left some serious amount of logs down here. I was looking. Yeah, right down there. Probably should pick those up when we cleared out this area here so we could snipe them. Didn't work out as well as I thought it would. But you know what? It's all good. All right, we've got a lot of tires on us now. I don't know if this truck needs tire rotation or not, or new tires. We'll just double check it before we delete them. Always good to have. Probably left some stuff behind without realizing. We'll see afterwards. Yeah, there's a couple of shitty tires on us. We'll just do a quick little swap out. That's good for me, and we'll do the other one too. Important to have good solid tires. This is actually pretty good. Uh, this battery here could probably change. We have really nice ones inside. Probably a good time to do it. My God, is seriously spawn back? Oh wow, these are like the fountain of fuel. This is a fountain of fuel, ladies and gents. This is absolutely stunning. Oh my God. Found a fountain of few ooh, that's a full tank right there dudes i can't do anything more i can only thing i do is maybe open this up and drop some in there and fill a tank up and now we can fill this thing back up again and pull out what i can that's four liters of that sucker man that's pretty good I'll fill the can up i'm not crazy i want that all emptied up as much as i possibly can when we come back up here and grab ourselves some vegetables from these dudes and you saw the weight difference too right this is stunning. Okay. We had a weight issue there at one point. 
because we're carrying like a crap load of fuel. It definitely has an effect to it. So real good. Looks like we killed off everybody here. Let's go and take here and head back down the road. Maybe pick up those logs on our way back. So we don't leave them out there. They are very handy for us to have. We are going to need them for building anyways. So now why you have the barn on this side if you can today. Whoa. Leo, one second. Thanks, buddy. Those are heavy. This is heavy. This is put anything that we're not using currently inside of here. So we can pick up those logs without any problemos. There we go. Nice. That's great. And there's still some of this rubbish here, which is what I left behind. Tendency of picking those up. If you chopped out a tree, make sure you pick up every little piece you can off the ground of leaves and sticks. It will make your game a whole lot better. Really, honestly. Like, see, look at this. This is all floating crap here. That's when I chopped out a tree. When it was really dark, couldn't see it. Don't we'll go park really close to our truck. Do a quick little drop off and head up to this place up top there because I have no more room really on me. Now I should be able to put some of these logs in here. Just jump out of this. There we go. Alright, Leo. Leo likes to drive this car. We have no choice. We gotta let him do it. There's a bandit right here in my freaking land. Look, him and Rachel. No problem. Rachel has no problem with him. He's freaking out now. He's realized what's happening. What kind of move was that? Oh. He was protected by that. I'm not sure how come, but he was. She shit Rachel too, I swear to God. She always have a tendency to screw me over. So these tires can go in there. That's not a problem. This is garbage too. That's garbage. That's garbage. The rest of the stuff is not so bad. I can kind of keep those. So let's put those aside for now. I'm not really going to eat that. I think I have stacks of those, so I'm not too worried. And we did pretty decent on fuel too, so I'm super happy about that. Okay, so all this other stuff here is like all stuff we're going to need afterwards and put back inside our vehicles. But we should have enough to go and pick up what's left over over there. Let's want to see what this guy has here. He's got himself another apple. Ah, he was trying to really romance her and all that, eh? Huh? Do you anything I need with you? No? I don't think he does. Usually you could pretty much see a little bit of it. All right, so what I'll do is I'll leave this truck back over here should I just back it up actually I'm thinking about it as the plants going good good stuff all right we're good to go we'll leave this there for now probably maybe grab the veggies and stuff uh the stuff I know that I'm gonna need to kind of take care of uh we are actually are thirsty too but I want to keep those carrots as much as I possibly can not a ton of them we didn't get a lot more than well, I was hoping a lot more than that. But we need to end up with something at least, so I'll take it. Better than nothing. This one needs to be sliced up. Let's harvest those up right away. And those little pieces here too. Should probably go and check out the traps in back. Let's just go and do that really quick. I'm not getting anything from these since I put up the wall and stuff. So I don't know. Let's reactivate it. Maybe that's just what it needs a little bit of. Just deactivate and reactivate. Maybe we killed off all the last rabbits and mice that we found. I just like them because of fat and stuff. I don't want to spend hours ripping apart a bear. Do we not? Usually we're just such in a hurry. I don't have time for that crap. So let's just see here. Harvest this up. Now, again, if you guys are not aware, do not eat raw tomatoes and stuff. Very bad idea. Or raw vegetables. Really didn't work out well for us last time. Not going to do it again. And we're just going to place these in here. Hopefully we can get this done. I mean, uh, there's definitely a lot of apple pea slices here. We can maybe make ourselves a couple more traps. Uh, we do have, of course, look at us. The fat didn't go bad at all. It's doing pretty good. And we have some broccoli that's about to go bad. Oh, people ask me, can I harvest this up to get seeds? That is a freaking good question. I've never tried to do it. 
They wouldn't think we could. No, we can't. There's no option for that either. If you right click, you can see it says eat. The same thing here, eat. We can't do anything with potatoes. And I don't think anything with the carrot either, which wouldn't make very much sense since they don't have seeds like that. But, you know, I'm just saying. It's a game after all. You don't know how they do things sometimes. And nope, that's on a... Nope, can't do it. But I had to test it. Good question, though. Very, very good question. All right, let's go and see this here. What do I need for this? I need one carrot, one potato, two meat. One carrot, one potato, two meat. That's going to cost for your meat source, dude. One carrot, one potato. Which one's the older one? There it is. Now, the broccoli is not as important, I think, until you start making the other stuff here on the bottom, which is going to take two of those. I don't have those, so we're just going to have to kind of deal with it a little bit. And I think we're going to have to grab ourselves some water, too, which is one of these. Now the bandits are all dead up top, so we shouldn't have any big problems. I'm going to do wood and stuff here. I'm not sure how much I'll get to start this up. 15 minutes. 24 minutes. Okay. I got too much of this crap anyway, so it's not like it's going to take forever. How long does it take to make this, by the way? 15 minutes. Yeah, we have more enough to do this, which is great. Oh, maybe the water will be an issue. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. All right, didn't. And now yeah, let's craft this up. Let's make ourselves four portions of this. Nice. That fire might go out. It's all good. Not a big deal. And we'll grab this here and take this our safe water area. Probably should have done from these, but right now I don't care. I'm all in good shape here. And actually, we are super thirsty, too. Holy moly. I'm not hungry. But at least we're going to be able to replenish ourselves here and then come back and eat afterwards. I'll fill these up later on. Not a big deal. And we have one at 17%. So at least it gives us a little bit more now. Food-wise, we're doing okay. We have a couple portions of food left. We're definitely going to need to make sure a buddy over here is well taken care of. We also have tons of cans. That's a big problem. Which is, I mean, it's a good problem to have, right? But it is a big problem right now. I don't have the room for them. Might have to store them in here for now. It's not going to make a big difference, but it's all going to do well for us. And I think we have a bucket over here we can put back inside here. We have a collection of buckets. Miles will make that happen. We'll close up our doors. We'll have to check a generator later on to make sure to fuel it up. Don't worry, buddy. Are you starving or something? Is that the problem? You can hold off for a tiny bit, right? We need to go back out. Let's do this. We're just going up the hill. If I get those center blocks, I'd be super happy. All right. Running up the hill. Is that Kate Bush? I think so. She's awesome. Some more manure there. We'll go around this edge of the outside first. Just clear it all up. Easy to miss stuff in this place. There's all these crates and stuff to kind of throw you off a tiny bit. Some more poop. Uh, people ask me about that too. You got to wait for the... Uh, people said once you shovel and put the poop in there. Definitely, you know, something we've tried, but unfortunately you can't do it now. You got to wait for the dev to release the new workstation, which I can't wait for that to happen. Where we can be able to make ourselves our own manure. All right. Nothing much in here. It's all been crap, literally. There's some crap there. And I'll take the manure to That's good stuff. Okay, there's this wonderful workbench, which I guess we can bring with us if we really need to. I need actually a new car batteries for my truck over there, which is great. I'll take the shotgun shells, big time. I don't think I'm desperate, but I'll take them they're offered just think i stepped in that too grabbed the tape and stuff anything inside the sinks no he's never hurt always good to have leo want to go outside go for it go for it boy just don't get lost don't get taken i appreciate it How much weight am I carrying? 85 pounds, right? Or 85%, sorry, not pounds, but 85%. 
We'll throw that in the garbage too. Some more paste. That's okay. And I think I got everything else here, right? Oh, some tape in a board in these drawers too. Which they don't spawn back anything really, so almost wanting to stop to look into it. Oh, jeans. How's my jeans? I might have had a couple of accidents. There we go. Not so bad, actually. In pretty good shape. Look at this. Crap, that's cool. This is a nice little place for a base, too. Uh oh Okay, thank you. It is a nice little place for a base. Again, it's just the space-wise, it's very tough to maneuver. Tough for survivors also to kind of fix up things. I think I might have to change the tires on the other side. Oh, some poop, too. Okay. How we do our tires here? Everything's good. They're in great shape. Even a battery is a 9.6. We could do a hot swap here really quick. Give yourself the 100% battery. Why not? We have tons of them. But I didn't see any bricks and stuff, and that's kind of making me freak out a little bit here. Let's just put all this stuff in here. A couple batteries, a couple stuff. There they are. There's some here. Okay, how many do we get for that? One. Uno. Well, you know what? One's better than none, right? Exactly. I got some soil. We can always use that afterwards. Nothing inside there, no. Well, you know what? You got to give props to this place. At least it gave me something that I could use. I'm still missing a few more. I mean, people were saying go back to the construction site. Absolutely. Definitely need it. But I was hoping to loot out the area at the same time and just getting it. I would love to steal this one. I don't know why. Just love the look of this. Love to see these on and working. Hoping a dev will do so. And again, if I miss something, you know what to do again, Confield. Let's put a timestamp on it. Tell me what I screwed up on. It's all good. Hey there, Scott. Hey, everybody. Nobody in here uh, trying to kill us? That's a plus. Looks like our plants are kind of dry over there. Do you see that, Leo? I'm going to back up so many times. God damn it. <laughs> and these two plus that. That's what I need to do right away. Actually, just one of these, right? Cool. I'll take the hot swap. That battery is pretty much dead, too. Not really liking that. Prefer to have all nice batteries. In case the guys shoot it up and stuff. We got a lot of trash. We have a lot of tires too, so not worried about that at all. Uh, we could go and uh, put that in there. I'm just going to need the hammer and stuff. And I also have the miracle Grow stuff here. Probably a good time to make an, something for the uh, garden too. Kind of lockers where you can put away all the gardening stuff. So we got a lot of it. I won't lie to you, we got a ton of it. Also, a shitload of tape. I don't think I need that right now. All right, let's go do the wiring really quick. Oh, wait a second. It's one's one, dude. I'll take it. It's one closer to finishing up. Right, Leo? You're hungry, aren't you? It's starting to show more and more. I'm starting to know this little doggy very well. Let's go and do this here. There you go. Six more left to do. They're looking pretty good. I am recording these back to back, so if you guys are pretty calm fields, always appreciate it. We'll be looking right after us. And I'm hoping you guys will tell me how many pieces of corn you know exactly if you waited, how long you waited. Just come back to my old videos too, where I you know, did that, but so many of them it's hard to find. Because so right now I have a couple of pieces of corn. It looks ready to me. Like this looks like it's ready to harvest. I'm just saying. It looks like it's time for this to harvest and move it over. Might have to do it for next episode. Bring all the stuff over to the other side and take care of it. Right now we have tons of loot. I'm trying to think if it should go to where the seekers are on the other side. Let's see if we can find those. I might go to town though first before that. There might be some cinder blocks around there too. Ah, so close, but yet so far. We did get some decent loot though. Look at this. Yeah, we got some pretty good amounts of stuff here. I don't know if the jeans, because I was wanting to check to see if I have all 100%. I do. We can actually fit one more set in there in case of emergency something happens. You know, it does happen, man. They can scare the shit out of you. So, miles will make it. 
work. That's some more to change yourselves up on. I think the tape wise though, I got like a whole bunch of these in weird. Like these broken down ones just taking up space for no reason when I can have like hundreds going in, which is so much better. These were affected by rain, so when the rain falls and you're holding on to these things, it just goes down to grade. So, you know, might as well get rid of the ones that are not. They're just taking up extra room because it's split them all up. It's all good. We have enough wood. I think we have enough of these too, but I'm not positive. I'm not sold on it yet. I would like to make another locker if I could. If I could make that happen, it'd be really nice. What am I going to need for that? Oh, this stuff here. I am keeping the grenade bits and stuff. I see 100%, 100%. Why is this not stacking? There we go. Uh, we do have quite a bit of gunpowder too. We're actually pretty decent shape at collecting also ammo. Look at this stuff. Don't forget the stuff in here. What are you, David Blaine? What the hell is going on, Leo? Don't ask questions, except the dog has superpowers we don't want to deal with. Okay. Uh, the big boy guns there, the ones for the truck. I think I have a couple in here already. I don't think we can harvest these at all. We can't do anything. Uh, I'm going to keep a couple just to make sure we're okay with it. If we don't need any more, we'll get rid of it. Oh, that's just hanging out. Extra apple is just there for in case of emergency. I have a tendency of that. We just like to leave stuff around. No, obviously it's a respawn, I know, but it's all good. Put this stuff back in here. And we even have a spark plugs. See, like these are really old here on the bottom, but I do like to be able to get some better sparks if we can make a big difference when we're building stuff. Okay, so we're pretty good there. Everybody's just standing around. Is that scary a little bit to you? Why are they all facing this side here? Are this like King of Suntan? Sometimes I think he's just tanning. You do realize you're... You're levitating, right, dude? Okay. We're all good. We're all good. All right. We got that pretty good. I think we'll make ourselves some walkers, get move over the stuff for the farm. For next episode, we need to get that going. Uh, there's still a lot to do. There really is a lot for us to get completed, so we're going to do that for next time. I can't wait to find out if I should take these apart or not. I keep on forgetting whether or not we should. don't remember which one of them was the right time to pick this. I think there's needing like a couple more cord on the top for it to really be ready. Uh, we'll find out. We'll see tomorrow how it goes. First things first, go get some rest right now. We're going to empty out the truck with the rest of the stuff here. It's doing pretty good. I'd like to get some more of this ammo or build, be able to actually do it and make our own. That would be pretty primo. But I think everything else, we're in pretty good shape. We still have just a couple of things left, and we'll deal with it and make ourselves some lockers too, bring things over, even make try to make a watchtower over here too. It would be really nice. A lot of work ahead of us. So thank you all for being here. If you guys are enjoying us, of course, show some love by hitting the like button. If you're brand new, Please go and subscribe. Thanks for being so amazing every single day. You guys are the best. This is Game Edge. I'm going to catch you guys on the flip side.